Yeah, hi. We are from SUS Embedded. The project title name is Manhole Detection and Monitoring System. So we are using total five sensors. Those are LM35 temperature sensor, MQ2 gas sensor by smoke sensor, and one fire sensor, and one tilt vibration sensor, and water detection full hole manhole full water detection sensor, and GSM SIM 800L. And a 16 cross 2 LCD display RS enabled D4, D5, D6, D7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And those sensors are connected with LM35 temperature sensor A0, smoke sensor A1, fire sensor A2, tilt vibration sensor digital output is connected to the 5th pin, water level digital output is 7th pin, GSM SMS alert. So let us coming into the hardware part. Okay. So here we are using a bridge rectifier, filter capacitor. 7805 regulator and one LED Arduino Uno R3 board 16 cross 2 LCD display character LCD display whatever the process is going on that should be displayed on the LCD so here we are using GSM SIM 800L we are using and LM35 temperature sensor and MQ2 gas sensor by smoke sensor and one fire sensor and tilt vibration sensor and water level full detection sensor okay now we are going for a step by step output okay gas gas detection okay gas 200 and above then only we will get the sms alert okay yeah 200 above so we got the sms alert gas alert okay smoke gas alert so now i am going the temperature alert yeah 53 so sir sir 55 and above yeah sms alert okay yeah fire sensor now i am going for fire fire alert yeah, over temperature alert. Fire alert. Okay. Yeah, fire alert. Okay. So, water level detection. Water is S. Over for full water. Yeah, water alert. Okay. Yeah, tilt vibration alert. Yeah, tilt vibration alert, water alert, fire alert, temperature alert. Okay. And then gas alert. So all five sensors, so we are getting one by one. If nothing should be happen, T for temperature, S for gas, F for fire, T for tilt, W for water. So there is no water alert and there, no, there is no tilt alert, temperature, fire. Okay, now I am going to give fire. Okay. Yeah, fire alert. Yeah, fire alert. Yeah, thanking you. If there is any doubt, let me know to SVS Embedded.